Okay, uh, today this video will show you how to create your own blog. So first of all, we need to open up a blog uh, chosen Webly because Webly provides a lot of nice templates that are easy to use, uh, especially for the beginner if never used anything like that. So I'm just going to open one and log out of my account so that I could show you from the beginning what it would look like. Okay, so first, if you are going to start a new one, dot com, don't go to the dashboard. I want to show you from the beginning what it looks like. So you go to this one, then go to the ads, because that's going to make you want to pay money. So you go to Webly Website Builder, plus in the Google search results. Go to Webly Website Builder. Here you will be taken to this page. Then you need to log in. Now, if you're already logged in with your email, it's a good idea to just click this red button that said G, G plus, log in. So it's a lot easier and you won't make mistakes in terms of putting the correct email address and so on. In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize your contact page or contact page um, Webly blog template. Okay, to start with, let's go to Webly uh, dashboard. This is called our dashboard. Again, to ref uh, refresh your memory, this part here is your basic elements to build your website or blog your blog um, these are the areas this is your pages section right the themes if you want to change if you want to upgrade to a store you can go there but we're not going there today we're looking at your pages so today we are customizing this one customizing your contact page of your website but since we are now here we are going to go back to the build section and the idea is we are going to drag an element from here on this side like a contact form so you just click there left click and drag it okay so now let go and drop it down inside here in this section so once once it's in there you can tell that um it's in there it just needs to be Customize, so you say, please leave your name, contact below. Try to resist the idea of you filling this in because you're the creator. This is for other people who wish to contact you through your blog. It is not meant for you, so don't fill it in, okay? If you're the creator, of course, you're going to save it. All right. The next thing is we need to put a map on this side. So you also need to drag a map, this one. So click, left click, and then you see the blue because the blue is there because that's where it's going to be. If you go up, the blue is up on the top, but it's no good. We want the map to the side. So we're going to click and drop. And you see the map here but it's not going to be your address until you customize it. So it's type uh, an address of your school or, or your students' um, contact address if they want to. Okay, so 245, 250 North Street. This is the school address. And then you are going to make sure you put the correct um, post address. So that's it. Press enter and click anywhere in the map. And that should bring that map in a local area. So can you see now that your contact address in your contact page is already customized?